Tonight, President Trump putting his own twist on the traditional July 4th celebration in the nation's capital. A display of military might and a big speech at the Lincoln Memorial. We're going to have planes going overhead, the best fighter jets in the world and other planes too. And we're going to have some tanks stationed outside. And now it's all here. The festivities featuring military flyovers and a fleet of battle tanks dotting the National Mall. It's a great use of our military and showing what we're all here for and what we're celebrating. The event drawing protesters, too. The Trump baby balloon appearing in the shadow of the Washington Monument. The White House reserved the best seats at tonight's event for Republican donors and guests of Trump's re-election campaign. Democrats hoping to replace the president, accusing him of playing politics. Donald Trump is handing out tickets to his big donors. That's a campaign event. I don't think he understands. This is America's birthday, not his birthday. And Democratic frontrunner Joe Biden out in Iowa, insisting he's still the one to beat, with polls showing Senator Kamala Harris gaining on the former VP after their debate stage showdown. What do you I'm say to still those way ahead. If you notice, I'm the guy everybody's talking about. Thomas Jefferson wrote and back here in Washington, after all the controversy the and criticism surrounding this event, it turns out the biggest obstacle be has been the weather. The skies have already opened up and thunderstorms are, are in the forecast. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.